Heavenly Father, I come before you this day asking for protection for my family, friends, and loved ones. Your word in Zephaniah chapter 3, verse 17, says that the Lord your God is with you, the mighty warrior who saves. He will take great delight in you. In his love, he will no longer rebuke you, but will rejoice over you with singing. I pray, Father, that you will take great delight in my family, friends, and loved ones. Protect and deliver them from evil. Thank you, Lord, for the beautiful family and friends you had gifted me with. It worries me that I cannot protect them from all the evil in the world. I am on my knees, Lord, asking for your help. Please watch over them when they step out. Send an angel to guide them home safely and avoid any harm they may face. Fill them, Lord, with your holy presence. Let them rest and be at peace. Let them feel your protection. Take away their fears and give them your peace that surpasses all understanding. Father, Lord, let no trouble befall them today. Allow no evil to influence their hearts. Cover them with the precious blood of Christ Jesus. Take charge over them so that they do not strike their foot against a stone. May you always preserve the bond that we have as a family. Give my family, friends, and loved ones the strength not to be afraid. Give them the courage to stand up to what is right. Produce within them an attitude of integrity, living their lives to give you glory. I pray for your emotional, physical, and spiritual protection over their lives. Isaiah chapter 41 verse 11 tells me that, Behold, all they that were incensed against you shall be ashamed and confounded. They shall be as nothing, and they that strive with you shall perish. Father, Lord, may you destroy those that strive against them. You are mightier than any evil force in this world. I believe in your power and strength to cover my family, friends, and loved ones. Proverbs chapter 4, verses 6 to 7 says that, Don't turn your back on wisdom, for she will protect you. Love her, and she will guard you. Getting wisdom is the wisest thing you can do. And whatever else you do, develop good judgment. Father Lord, stir the heart of my family, friends, and loved ones to earnestly chase after wisdom. Help them to develop good judgment. Guide their steps and provide them with directions in all areas of their lives. I pray that in good or bad times, you will continually be on their lips. Though the earth may shake and the rain may come, they will not be shaken because you are always with them. Be their source of hope and fill them with complete joy and peace. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.